Hello, my name is Marumbo Mkandawile. I'm a Comfort Association member from Malawi and currently I'm the District Operations Officer for Mwanza, the southern part of Malawi. So, as you know, Malawi has been affected by the cyclone, tropical flood, uh, which has hit the country in the southern part. Almost 10 districts have been affected. And as we talk, uh, currently we've lost a lot of lives and people have lost their belongings such as their housings, uh, their items and uh, a lot of other materials. We see districts such as Blantyre, Mulanje, Palombe, Chirazulu, many people have been affected and many Kama members have been affected. Many Kama members have lost their businesses and many other people have also lost their lives and some people are still missing even today as we speak. Here in the southern part schools were closed for almost two weeks as we were trying to settle down and as Kama members we've been working towards uh, supporting people in the camps and helping other people in the schools and the communities so that they can regain their lives. As Kama members we've been contributing uh, some small things that we have like clothes, we've been uh, contributing money and food stuffs so that we, we can help the people who have been affected. So it is very important for young women to be equipped with climate change knowledge because they are able to sensitize about climate change in their communities. And young women, we are able to take lead in climate change activities so that we can help our communities get prepared with each and every event that is coming towards us. We are helping different children in schools to learn about climate change by helping them to know which ways we can use to mitigate climate change, such as planting trees, so that we can be able to have the environment that is green and help to mitigate the gases that are in the air. And we are also working with uh, different stakeholders in our communities who are also helping in the mitigation of climate change by sensitizing in the communities and making sure that people are aware of each and every uh, uh, weather forecast event that is coming towards our country. And on this World F Day, I would say people should uh, plant more trees and people should also sensitize other people who do not have knowledge about climate change and go deep into the topic so that people may be able to know what changes are there in the environment and people may be able to know what are the things that are causing climate change and people may be able to know what to do so that they can all help into mitigating this climate change because together we can.